Hello friends, my name is Raj, and welcome to my channel, me, myself and my vlogs. Please watch my full video without skipping, and if you like the video, please give a like, subscribe to my channel, and don't forget to click the notification icon, thank you. To make your learning easy, and understandable, I have separated this complete tutorial, into 10 parts. In the part 1 of the tutorial, I will be teaching you how to draw an eye. In the part 2 tutorial, I will be teaching you how to draw eyebrows, and, in the part 3, I will be teaching you how to draw a nose, and so on. So, by the time you finish the complete tutorial, you would have learned how to draw a complete human figure, with all the features. So let us get started. In this part 1 of the tutorial, I am going to teach you, how to draw a human eye, using a very easy, and simple, guiding dots method. So, let's get started. Materials you need for this tutorial are, any normal pencil, an eraser, a sharpener, and a normal white paper, or a drawing book. At this beginner level, you don't have to invest in any expensive drawing materials. As we progress to next level, I will recommend some good drawing materials for you. But, for the time being, any normal pencil will do, but the condition is, it has to be very sharp throughout our drawing. So keep sharpening it. By the way, please ignore the circle. I drew it, just to center the camera, to the drawing. Now let us place our first dot. Okay. Now before placing the second dot, you have to decide, what would be the size of the eye you are going to draw. If you are going to draw a small eye, then place the second dot bit closer. Or, if it is going to be a bigger eye, place the dot a little bit far. Now, let us place the third dot. The third dot should be placed in the center of the first and second dot, but, a little bit lower. Okay. Now the fourth dot should again be placed, in the center of the first and second dot. But, a little bit higher. Excellent, there you go. You are doing great. Now, let us place our fifth dot. The fifth dot should be placed closer to the first dot little bit lower. That's it, we have finished placing our main primary dots. Now let us place the secondary dots. The secondary dots are also called as the connecting dots, which are placed between the primary dots. But, placing the secondary dots is completely optional. You can complete the shape without using secondary dots but, I recommend you to place the secondary dots to get a better shape, because you are a beginner. Now, place the secondary dots in between the primary dots and connect all the dots slowly, and steadily. Do not forget, you pencil strokes should be very much lighter and thinner, at this point of time, do not draw darker add thicker strokes unless required, otherwise, it would be harder for you to erase the thicker strokes, if you go wrong somewhere, and even after erasing, they leave behind crease lines, which will make the drawing look ugly. So, lighter the strokes, the better the drawing. Excellent, now we have got the shape of a human eye. Now, let us draw the eyeball. The eyeball should be drawn at the center of the eye. And the eyeball should be drawn, in a perfect circle. I know drawing a perfect circle at this stage, is not an easy task for you, but, there is no other alternative to it, because the eyeball is meant to be in a perfect circle shape. Before drawing the eyeball in your main drawing, I would suggest you to practice drawing a circle on a rough paper and then, once you are confident enough, you can draw it on your main drawing so that, you can avoid repeated erasing, which may damage the paper. One more important aspect for drawing an eyeball is, it should be a 3 fourth circle not a full circle. Now let us draw the eye pupil. The pupil should be drawn at the, the center of the eyeball. First start off by placing a dot in the center of the eyeball. Now, slowly increase the size of the dot by darkening it, without losing its shape. Excellent, now we are done with it. Now draw two small strokes one either side of the pupil. And, start shading on either side of the strokes, little bit. You can shade them darker.
Now shade the remaining part of the pupil very very lightly, and please avoid shading the areas between the two strokes. Because, that portion is meant to be white throughout our drawing. I am repeating again, do not shade the area between the strokes. Now draw two curves on either side of the inside eye. Now if you are happy with the whole shape of the eye, you can darken all the strokes of your drawing. Start shading very lightly on the two corners of the eye, just a little bit. Now, let us draw an outline, around the eye, following the same shape, and by using the dots. Now, shade the gap of the upper outline. Now, draw another curve above the eyelashes using dots, and following the shape of the eye. Let us start shading the area above the upper eyelid. Start shading on the right and the left side, with medium pressure strokes, and do not shade the center area. This will give a 3D effect to your upper eyelid. Okay, 
Now darken the curve to indicate the shadow. Now, let us draw the eyelashes. Eyelashes, are drawn as a little curves, facing upwards just above the upper eyelid, and lower eyelid. They may look simple, but, takes lot of practice. If not drawn properly, they may ruin the whole eye. So, watch how I am drawing them, and follow carefully. Now we have almost finished drawing the eye and keep watching the video, till the end. So, if you like this video and found it helpful, please give a like, and share it with your friends, and subscribe to my channel, and do not forget to hit the notification bell, so that you will be notified when I post my new video. Thanks for watching, and happy sketching!